Hey, what's up guys? Hope everyone is doing well. So the Packers just came in and made a move. Um, as I was actually working on my training camp video, so that should be out after this video right here. But the Packers have come in and claimed outside linebacker Chancey Rivers or Chauncey Rivers off of waivers from the Ravens. It was reported here from Rob Domofsky. He said the Packers have claimed outside linebacker Chauncey Rivers off waivers from the Ravens per a source. You might remember him from Last Chance You documentary. I actually don't think I saw the one with him in it. I've actually seen other ones like the basketball one. It's really good. I haven't seen all the football ones, so I missed that, but that's pretty interesting. And he says he's on his way to Green Bay and will be in the building tomorrow. Could practice as soon as family night on Saturday. So um, this is an interesting move for the Packers. I guess maybe it can make sense just because, you know, Randy Ramsey, who was potentially the fourth guy behind, um, what's his name? Rashawn Gary. He went down with an injury that seems pretty serious. So it seems that the Packers want to come in and add some more depth out the out, at the outside linebacker position. Um, so a little bit about this guy. He started off at Georgia, but was then dismissed for the team, I think, for a marijuana charge. Um, and then he went on to play for East Mississippi Community College, which is where I believe he was in the last chance U. I think that's a college I was featured in whichever season that was. Because I'm pretty sure there's like three or four seasons of that show. I've seen like one of them, but not this one. Um, while he was there, he had 45 tackles and eight sacks. And then he transferred to Mississippi State. And then his senior season, he led the team with eight tackles for loss and five sacks. And then he uh, went, or and then in 2020, he I guess he was ready for the draft. Didn't get drafted in 2020. Went undrafted. And then the Ravens come in and pick him up. And then he spent most of his 2020 season on the um, on the Ravens practice squad. I believe he was called up maybe for one game, but then went immediately back to the practice squad for the Ravens. Um, but then it came out yesterday, the Ravens like released him, and then I guess he cleared waivers. The Packers picked him up um, today. So a little bit of information about this guy. I found a little scouting report from NFL.com, so I thought I would read that, give us a little idea sort of about this guy. Um, he's 6'2". I can't find his weight right now. I think he's 6'2", and he is how many pounds is this man? He is 262 pounds, according to NFL.com. Has 32 and 7 8 inch arms, for anyone who cares about that. 9 and 3 4 inch inches hands. Um, I know that people look at that for scouting and stuff, but I'm not a scout, so I don't know if that's good or not. So if you are a scout, let me know if those like body measurements are good or not um, when it comes to arms and hands. If anyone knows that, I have no idea. Um, but then now to the scouting report. It says, edge worker with ability to beat blockers with strong hands, or initial quickness, depending on the matchup. His pad level and contact balance help win inside to disrupt the B-gap. He takes on bigger blockers with sharp hand strikes before sliding away, but Maulers can overwhelm him at times. His rush isn't very toolsy, but it is fairly fluid and should improve once he adds to the tool belt. Rivers' issues at Georgia were documented in Season 2 of the Netflix documentary series, Last Chance U, but the re reset at Mississippi State offered consistent production and play over two seasons, Look for teams to consider him as a 3-4 Sam backer with enough short area athleticism to handle the transition. So that is all of the um, important information on this new addition to the Green Bay Packers. Will he end up making the final roster? I don't know. We'll have to wait and see once the roster comes out, but I think it could be tough for him, but you never know. Who knows what's going to happen with this guy? Um, and also one other move the Packers made, they released the long snapper Joe Fortunato, Fortunato, however you say his name. So he is gone as well. So those are the two things that just happened for the Packers. And if you guys want to see some more stuff from the Packers, all the news, everything that goes down, that's what this channel is for. So for into that, feel free to subscribe to the channel. All you got to do is like click it, you know, it's, it's pretty simple. So that's all you got to do. But um, that is going to be all for this video. And as I was saying earlier, the training camp video, the update for today, some things that went down should be out like within an hour after this video. So if you're watching this and it just came out, look for that other video in like an hour or so because um, that's when it should probably, probably be up. But thank you guys for watching as always and I'll see you guys next time.